Come your lado, switch sides. Next, coming up, hug yourself and rotate. Ah, em português, vamos mudar a palavra vítima para eu sou vitorioso. Desculpa, esqueci. Switch sides. Câmbio. Lado. Troca o lado. Next one, coming up, we're going to touch our foot, side to side, get set, ready, action. Around the world. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, and five, and six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. Next, coming up, side lunges, okay? One, back, Now we're going side lunges, side lunges, front lunges, side lunges, side lunges, and front lunge. Ready? Action!
This one, this side lunges. One side. That's it. Are you ready? Action. Switch sides. Get set. Get ready. Action. Next, coming up, we're going to hold, lunge, side lunge, get set, are you ready, action, sit on your heel, push your butt back, hold, switch sides, sit on your butt, I mean, on your heel, Make sure the weight should be on your heel, okay? Okay, up. Now, point your toes out. Next one, side to side. Get set. Are you ready? Action. Get lower. Push your butt back. Alright, next one coming up. We're going to walk. Walk, 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 all the way. Stretch. Walk back. Up. Walk, 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 and we stretch. And walk back. Copy. Get set. Are you ready? Action. Next, coming up, we're going to squat, lift the arm up, squat and lift the arm up. Get set, are you ready? Action!
next one, coming up. The arm and the leg is going up simultaneously. Get set. Are you ready? Action. Coming up, squat and kick throughs. Squat and kick throughs. Get set. Are you ready? Action. One, coming up, squat, push up, squat, push up, get set, are you ready, action. Next one, we're going to squat, step the leg, over, step the leg forward, back, squat, step the leg, squat, and just step the leg. You don't have to look up yet, okay? Get set, are you ready? Action. Alright, now we we'll kick through. One, two, three, back. One, two, three, and back. Get set. Are you ready? Action. Next one. We're going to touch the toe, alternating sides.
Open the leg. Open your legs. And level one, keep your hands on the mat. Level two, drop on your elbows. Level three, grab your ankles. Get set. Are you ready? Action. back please and next one coming up one one and boom forward back one one and then forward wait 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 just wait a second let's do it together okay myself just ask him to join the class All right, get set. Are you ready? Action. Level one, keep your hands on the mat. Level two, drop on your elbows. Level three, drop on your chest. All right, get set. Are you ready? Action. Move your legs side to side. Just loosen up. Loosen up the hips, the joints. All right. So now, since we're warm, our body on our body is warm. I'm going to. Do the break this all the way up, kick back again to the position, roll on the shoulder, get to the other side, hit the switch on the other side, kick, break this up, combat base, touch the toe, go down again as we're going down, roll. And head to the other side. Once you get to the side, don't forget to switch sides. And then we'll keep on doing it. Copy. All right, get set. Are you ready? Action.
As we're getting better, try not to use your hands on the mat. Try not to touch your hands as we're getting better. Time. Get a sip of water. We come up on the elbow, first orientation. We come up on the elbow. As we come up on the elbow, we're going to use our agility to pull back to the guard on the other side. My right leg is going to be a tripod, and I'm going to recover on the other side. We're going to serve our legs, one, two, three, come up on the elbow, get the leg in base, and throw. If I start, start with the right leg, I recover with my left leg on the other side. I start with, I start off with my left leg straight, pull back, and right leg pulling back to the guard on the other side. Does it make sense to everybody? All right, get set. Are you ready? Action. Don't forget to circle your legs. Close guard. I'm going to break my partner's posture. Left foot goes to the mat. Come up on my elbow, scoot back. Get to the Kimura. Once I get the Kimura, I'm going to throw my right leg over my partner's lower back, falling at the 90 degree angle. Squeeze, finish. Back again. Close guard. Break the posture. Grab the wrist, C grip on the wrist in the beginning, left foot goes to the mat, come up on my elbow, scoot back, see I'm scooting back, scoot back, get to the kimura, switch the C grip to the hooks, monkey grips, monkey grips, throw the leg over my partner's lower back, falling at the 90 degree, my partner's head is here, and I'm falling at the 90 degree angle. Keep the arm bent, bring my partner's elbow to my chest, and bring the elbow, I mean the wrist to the back of my partner's head. My partner's wrist to the back of my partner's head. Finish. Close guard. Copy. Yes? Alright. 
Get set. <coughs> Are you ready? Action. Time. Next one. Break the posture. Don't grab the wrist. Don't grab the wrist. Break the posture. Unlock your guard. Come up on your elbow. Scoot back. Straight arm. Grab your partner's arm. Hook your partner's leg with your, in this case over here, my right leg. I'm going to lift my hips above my partner's hips. Scissor. This leg. As I bring my first arm around my waist and step this leg over the top simultaneously. Bring the arm around the waist, seize the leg, and step the leg over to the mount position. So one more time, hip pumps with. Break the posture. Don't grab the wrist. Left foot goes to the mat. Come up on my elbow. I scoot back, straight the arm, grab the elbow, lift my hips up. When I lift my hips up, I'm going to bring the arm around my hips simultaneously. Scissor the leg and step the leg over. <coughs> Copy. All right, get set. Are you ready? Action. Hip pump whip. My partner is going to block. When my partner blocks the hip pump whip, I transfer the hip pump whip into Kimura. So I break this posture, okay? Mistake. If I, I, I forgot to unlock my close guard, come up and try to do the hip bump, unlock right now, try to do the hip bump sweep, then it's going to push my back on the mat, yeah? So, I break her posture, get my left foot on the mat, come up on my elbow, scooting my hips back to make a space. If I forget to scoot my hips back, and I'm trying to go for the Kimura, and I forgot to straighten my arm, go for it and push me, fight me. She's gonna fight, fight me through. She's going to fight me through, okay? And she'll be able to flat me on my back. So, I gotta break her posture, get my left foot on the mat, come up on my elbow, scoot my hips back, straighten my arm. As I scoot back, straight the arm, go, go for it, Danny. She can't. She can flat me on my back, and I'll be able to Lift my hips above, get above Dennis' hips. If I forget to do that, I'm going to. Let's say that I forgot to lift my hips above Dennis' hips. Let's see what's going to happen. Fight me through Dennis. She's going to fight me through. If I lift my hips above her hips, go for Dennis. She won't be able to flat me on my back. Look at the hook. Everybody, can, I'm going to turn this away here. I have the hook. Now, I'm going to bring her arm around my waist, scissor my bottom leg, yeah? And now I can step my left leg over. Company, what if I see that some people, they drop the leg. If you drop the leg and try to scissor, then it's going to step the leg over. Yeah? That's the reason why I like to hook. If Daddy is not sitting on her heel, I hook. If she's sitting on the heel, I just hook with my knee up. Lift the hips above her hips, scissor the leg. Now I can step the leg over. Okay, with that being said, we got this part. We know the mistakes. Now I'm going to break her posture. 
Get my left knee on the mat. Come up with my elbow. Scoot back. Immediately straight my arm. Hook the leg. Lift my hips up. Bring her arm around my waist and try to do the hip bump swift. Then it's going to block me. She blocks me. If I don't commit to the hip bump swift, in this case over here, I just fake. Let's say I fake the hip bump swift. I just fake. This, no, then it's going to pose here. And I'll try to do the kimura. When I try to do the kimura, then it's going to grab around my waist before I grab her breast. Okay? Because I just faked. I faked the kimura. Excuse me, I faked the hip bump swift. Now I'm going to do the hip bump swift, which is going to block. Let's assume that I'm going for the kimura and then it's trying to grab around my waist. Go ahead, go, go grab them. She can't. She's, right? She's sweat. Yeah? So, when she pulls, that's the reason why we need to go for the hip bump swift. Commit to the hip bump swift. Now, mistake we make. Look at the mistake we make as we're going to the kimura for the hip bump swift. I drop my elbow right here and trying to bring Dennis' arm to me. And then it's going to grab around my waist once again. Okay. So when we get to this position, my elbow is going to drop as close as possible to Dennis' breast. There. From here to there. And I'll be able to grab my own breast, fall at the 90 degree angle. Don't close your guard. If you close your guard, my part is going to roll on the shoulder. Roll, Danny. She's going to roll there. Go back. Step the leg over, keep the knee connecting to the hips. Top leg, control the lower back. Left knee, control Dennis. Hips, keep the arm bent. I don't want to see Dennis' arm straight this way because this way I'm going to crank on the elbow. I want to crank on the shoulder. Keep the arm bent as a V. Keep the elbow on the chest and bring the wrist to the back of her head. Slow and she's going to tap. She'll tap, I'll let her go. Does it make sense to everybody? Yeah? You got it? Alright, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to practice the hip bump swip to Kimura.